okay? This is... Can I take a closer look at this? Wow. It's really well made. Thank you. This will really help. Sorry for the trouble. I could have made it myself if you gave me the recipe. No problem. I thought it would be easier on you if I made it instead. You really are such a good girl, Beerus. It's almost a shame that you're the apprentice of someone like me. That's not true. You're my one and only teacher, Miss Sophie. Beerus. Oh, by the way, what are you going to use that for anyway? Ah, right. This is needed to make Plakta's body more human-like. It's a long explanation, but... And that's how it works. Did you understand all that? Not one bit. <laughs> Good answer. I'm not exactly doing something normal after all. I still have a lot to learn. You took the time to explain it, but I didn't understand a thing. No, it's not that big a deal. Seeing how you were able to make the item, that means you have considerable power as an alchemist already. You already know a lot, Beerus. I think you should be more confident in your own abilities. You've become a great alchemist. As your teacher, I'm really proud. Teacher? I'm glad I could help. Thanks for coming, Pyrrhus. How long should I rest? Good night.
rest. Good night. Thanks for... Teacher! Do you want to try synthesis together again? I want to learn more! Oh, sure. I don't mind. 
but this is pretty sudden. What's up? I was thinking about before. There are still lots of things I don't know. You said I've become a great alchemist, but... I want to become even better! <laughs> An admirable frame of mind. How will you respond, Sophie? In that case, of course I'll accept. I can't refuse my adorable apprentice. Okay then, maybe we should start by gathering again today. Good synthesis requires good materials after all. I got it! So, where are we going this time? Let's see... We should go back to the same place as last time. We should find really good materials there. Okay! Then let's hurry on over! Yeah! This is a steep path. You must walk... Where are we going? This is interesting. Ooh, I found a campfire! Up, up and away! Then, what will we find today? This is exciting, isn't it, Ferris? Yeah, very! <laughs> Let's gather lots of stuff! Yep. <laughs> Those two seem to be having fun. Yes. Although they're perhaps a little too excited. <sighs> Teacher! There's a pretty rock over there! Oh, you're right! Let's go take a look. Hey! Don't run off like that. It's fine. You worry too much, Plakta. Let's see. Yeah, this is good ore. I feel like something shook just now. Uh -huh. ah! Sophie? Probably a cave underground. The ground gave way, so we fell in. No way! We lost our bags, too! What's going to happen to us? Don't give up, Ferris. I'm sure we'll be fine. Liana and Plakta will probably do something about this. We just need to do what we can. Do what we can? Yeah. Sorry, but could you look around here for an exit or something useful? I'd like to help look, but I can't with my leg like this. Teacher... Okay, I got it! This is... All because I said I wanted to do synthesis. No, this isn't the time to be thinking like that. I need to look around, for teacher's sake too!
Welcome back. How'd it go? It's no good. I found what looks like an exit, but... Oh, really? Then just leave me behind and... <sighs> I thought you'd say that. I won't! I can't just leave you behind! Also, it seems like there are monsters nearby. Even if I went off alone, it would probably be the end of me. I see. Then I guess we just have to trust in Pacta and Liana. And wait. Are you hungry too? Yeah... Miss Sophie? You look kind of pale! Huh? Really? Ah! You're burning up! Is this because of the injury? What should I do? At this rate, teacher will... I need to do something! Anything to help her! Effects. That voice I heard, though, is that you? I want to become Madison. I want to help her. Will you fulfill my wish? Yeah, I'll fulfill your wish. I'll take good care of you. Thank you. Thank you, too. It's done! It was a little slapdash, but this should help, teacher. Here, drink this! Yeah, thank you. Okay, now you just need a little rest. I'll get some sleep, too. Beerus! Beerus! Mm -hmm. Sophie, I can't eat anymore. Theris, wake up! Uh, Sophie! Uh, is it okay for you to be walking around? Yeah, I'm all better. Thanks to the medicine you made. Also, there's nothing else to worry about now. We found your backpack, Theris. It didn't seem like anything was missing. Theris, you're awake! I'm glad. I'm so glad! Leah! Plakta! They showed up to help a little while ago. But you were fast asleep, so... It seemed you had lost your backpack, so we went to look for it in the meantime. I'm very sorry. The path to get here was more complicated than anticipated. So, it took a while to come help. That's okay. Thank you very much, Plakta. You too, Leah! No problem. Anyway, let's go back to the Atlier. I'm sure you're still tired, so you should rest in bed. Yes, that would be best. We need to properly treat Sophie's wound as well. Yeah, you're right. Let's go, Furious. That voice... 
Was that all just a dream? Hmm. Beerus? What's wrong? Oh, sorry. It's nothing. I'll be right there. Grow stronger with the plants. This is interesting. Up, up and away. Back down. Come out, Atlier. Right. Here. This is my way of saying thanks. You know, because you made medicine for me back when we fell. <sighs> you don't need to thank me for that. <laughs> There's no need to hold back. You should accept it. Okay, I got it. I'll take it gratefully. By the way, Furious, how did you find the ingredients for that medicine? It didn't look like there were any useful plants growing down there. Um... I suddenly heard a voice saying, I want to become medicine. Then I found it where the voice was coming from. Wait, that's... Sorry, Furious. I need to check something. This ore. Do you know what it's saying? Huh? Hmm... I want to become armor. Strong armor that can protect people! I heard something just now. Um... It said it wants to become... Armor? Then what about this? I want to become clothes. Cute, dazzling, and beautiful clothes. It wants to become clothes. That's what I heard, at least. Uh, they're both right! You did it, Beerus! You can hear the voices of materials now! Huh? These are the voices of materials? Yeah, most likely. Congratulations, Ferris! It seems you really do have natural talent. It's extremely rare to hear actual voices from materials. You should be proud of such power and aim to become an even greater alchemist. get it but I understand if these are the voices of materials then that plant really did want to help teacher it's because of you that she was saved thank you Hey, Ferris. Would you like to observe some plants together? Yo, Ferris!
should I rest? Good night. <sighs> I want to become delicious sweets. I want to satisfy someone who's hungry. Okay, I got it. Then I'll turn you into sweets. I want to become a magnificent bomb. I may be plain, but I want to show off with a big bang. Then you'll become a bomb. <laughs> I'm totally used to hearing the voices of materials now. But why did I suddenly start hearing them? It's kind of strange. I should ask my seniors about things like this. I'll go talk to teacher. <laughs> that look on your face means you have something to ask me, doesn't it? So, what is it? Ask your teacher anything you want. Well, um... Why do you think I suddenly started hearing voices from materials? Hmm... hmm. Now that I think about it, that did happen. Although, it seems like you should have started hearing them sooner. I agree. In that case, it would be natural to think that something served as a stimulus. A stimulus? Theorists, what exactly happened back then? Some sort of cause... Hmm... Let's see... Well, right before I started hearing the voice, I thought about needing to help you, teacher. There wasn't really anything weird that happened. I see. I have a hypothesis then. Oh, really? That's great, Plakta! Can you tell us? She wished to help another. Having a strong will to do so may be important. By sensing the kind heart of one who wishes to help others, the materials may also express their wishes more strongly. Those stronger wishes are then heard as actual voices. Huh? But when it happened for me, I wasn't really thinking like that. Remember it more carefully. Didn't you always have a certain dream? To make everyone happy with alchemy. Oh, so that's what did it? Anyway, it's just a hypothesis. I can't guarantee that it's correct. But you're both very kind-hearted alchemists. I'd like to believe that this hypothesis is true. Yeah, you're right. I don't know about me, but I know Ferris is really kind. You should continue to use that power to help lots of people, Furious. Yeah, I got it! I promise! I thought of a new item! <laughs> I'll try making the new item! Yo, Furious! What should I make? What material should I use? Is this okay? Is this okay? Is which catalyst okay? Pump the pump the pump the pump material material this goes material this goes material. Time to start making it! Looks pretty good! We're pretty good at making this now! Lakta, we need to be quiet! Make sure Ferris doesn't notice! <sighs> what are you doing, teacher? <laughs> oh, Ferris! Um, nothing at all! Now this is suspicious. You just said you didn't want me to notice. So you heard that. Of course she would notice. Did you really think you could hide this? Just give up, Sophie. Your apprentice is obviously taking offense. Um, I got it. I'll tell her. Um, you see, we're preparing to travel. We're... Thinking about splitting up with you soon. Oh, I see. Splitting up with... Wait, what? Well, 
but why? And so suddenly... You've become a fine alchemist already. So I thought it was about time for you to go independent. N no I don't want that! We're finally able to travel together! I want to stay together longer! But, you know, you'll have to separate from me sometime. Huh? But your teacher is Plakta, right? You're always with Plakta! You aren't independent from her! I can't really counter that. <laughs> she hit you right where it hurts. Please, at least just a little longer? I don't want to split up again. Beerus. Okay, I got it. Then how about we keep traveling together forever? Huh? Forever? I'd be happy, but... Is that really okay? Of course! I've been thinking... With you, my dream... No, me and Plakta's dream will definitely come true. Both of your dreams? Yes. My dream is the same as Sophie's. In other words... We, we wish, wish to bring, bring everyone, everyone happiness through alchemy. alchemy! I think we could make way more people happy if you're with us, Ferris. In fact, with you along, it may even be possible to bring joy to everyone in the world. Yeah! That's why I think it would be wonderful if our dream became your dream too, Ferris. Of course, you don't have to answer right this minute. If you have other things you want to do, we don't mind if you choose to do that instead. Yes, you must decide your own path in life for yourself. Regardless of the path you choose, we shall support your decision. Teacher... Plakta! Alright, let's put off the preparations for now. Plakta, let's make some tea. Help me out. Yes. I understand. A journey with my teacher... to make everyone happy with alchemy. That would definitely be fun! <laughs> I think I found what I want to do! What I want to do is... to keep traveling with my teacher... forever! should I use? Is this cat time to spice those materials? This those materials is time to start making it. Yeah, this is fine. Interesting. Now, where should we go next? <laughs> the scenery is already feeling a little nostalgic. As I go forward in life, what exactly do I want to do?
Ferris's meeting with an alchemist named Sophie was what led to her leaving Ertona for the first time. Sophie had a certain dream to bring happiness to everyone with alchemy. Having decided to travel together, her dream gradually became Ferris's dream as well. Are you ready, Ferris? Yeah, I'm all set. Sorry for the wait. Don't worry, it's fine. This will probably end up being a long journey after all. I think it's good to be overprepared. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> what is it? You have a rather soft expression on your face. Nothing much. I started thinking that we get to keep traveling together. <laughs> I see. I'm happy that we get to travel together too. I feel the same way. Although, I also feel like I have another apprentice to keep watch over now. Hey, you're always so quick to say things like that, Plakta. I don't know about me, but you don't need to keep watch over Ferris. So you agree that you require it? Oh, um, that's not really... <laughs> oh, you! <laughs> anyway, we should get going. Yes. We don't have a particular destination, but our goal is clear. Yeah, our goal is to bring happiness to everyone through alchemy. That's right! I'm sure we can do it! All right then, let's set out, Ferris! How long should I rest? Good night!
I'll come up with something. Or maybe not. Where are we going?
What material should I use? Is this okay? Catalyst. Oh, this goes, this goes. Material. I'll put this, I'll put this. It's time to start making it. Well, what trait does... Okay, we've been pretty good at making this now. Should I make? What would be best? Is this which <laughs> material? Material? This goes. This goes. Materials is okay then. Time to dress it. Which traits should I? Is okay. It's done. I'm used to making this now. What material should I use? I'll put this goes, this goes, I'll put the materials. Okay then. Time to make this in. Which traits should I do? Okay, it's done. What material should I use? Is I'll put this goes, this goes, material. I'll put this is okay then. Time to make this. Which traits should I do? All done. Should I use? Is the time this goes, this goes, material, material, materials? Is time to start making it. Well, what traits should it have? Is all done. What would be best? Is this material, material, material? This goes, material. Is okay then. Time to draw. What traits should it have? Is all done. This is... Which traits should I choose? Okay, it's done! I'm used to making this now. I'm used to making this now.
like I'll come up with something. Or maybe not. What will you buy? Is this... Thank you! Is this okay? Thank you! Is this okay? Thank you! should I use? Should I use? Is this okay? Is this? 
Material should I use? to coming up with an idea.
I'll do what I can with everything I've got. I'm sorry if this hurts. Easy win, easy win. That issue's settled. I'll do what I can with everything I've got. That hurt! This is alchemy! I'm sorry if this hurts! This'll hurt! I can do it! Give me courage. I can take your place. Ow! I can do it. I'm sorry if this hurts. Take this. This'll hurt. That was kind of rough. My journey continues. Did I get stronger? Really? I grow stronger with the plants. Treasure! Come to me! Now, where should we go next? Books? <laughs> this reminds me of the past. Hey! Hey! Welcome to the Observation Institute. Very well. I'll check it now. Thank you very much. This is your reward for today. We'll be awaiting your next visit. I wonder if I can borrow a martial arts book. I need to review once in a while. Okay!
happy that I get to travel with you, Ferris. I'm really glad I was able to become your teacher, Ferris. Is there something you wish to know? Should I rest? Good night.
item. <laughs> I'll try making the new item. What should I make? picky about books. I'm sure you know why. Um, where to next? As I go forward in life, what exactly do I want to do? what I want to do. Hmm. <laughs> 
Oscar, a young man who can hear the voices of plants. Virus also gained the power to hear the voices of materials. After parting with a plant named Chelsea, they were determined to befriend plants around the world. A journey of two people who can converse with plants. It would be just a little different from an ordinary journey. Hey, look, Fyrus. There's a pretty flower blooming here. I've never seen one like this before. It might be a type of tawn. Uh, really? It doesn't look much like a tawn to me. <sighs> Are you saying you don't trust my judgment? That's not really what I'm trying to say, but... I just don't think it looks like a tawn. All right, then. In that case... Hey, excuse me. You're a type of tawn, right? Hey, he's wrong, isn't he? You aren't a type of tawn, are you? Fyrus, you can't say it like that. You're scaring it. Y you're the one at fault! You're the one who's scaring it! <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter what this plant's called? Yeah, it doesn't matter what species it is. It's still an individual. Yep. Anyway, back to the point. Um, excuse me. Would you like to be our friend? <laughs> <laughs>